it's great to be back again. Right, yes, I've been away for a month. I do apologise. I needed to get away from everything for a month and I'll get into it a bit more as we shave. Right, let's get back into it. What are we using? See from the thumbnail. Holy cow. Italian holiday. What a beautiful scent. Oh, I'd say the scent strength is about, about a five. And the notes in this is leather, raspberry, honey, coffee, clary sage, amber, and th th there's, there's woody notes in there as well. I get the wood. Yeah, the, the leather and the raspberry is in the background. Can't so much smell the amber. Not to my nose anyway. And what's going to help? Tallow based. <laughs> Yeah, tallow, buffalo tallow, and if you can see, if you want to pause that, there's the ingredients. Brush, I'm going to be, oh, got some in my cobalt Captain's Choice bowl. I'm going to be whipping that up with my, it says tricolour, my Razorock 24mm synthetic Italian barber. So I'll get that into soak. Razor, razor of choice. I've, I've got a meeting today, um, so I want to go clean shaving, obviously. And uh, I, 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 it wasn't the, the shave I wanted to do. It's sort of a shave I have to do, because I, I haven't used this razor before, and I want to save it for the, the next shave. Shut up, Chris. Right, <laughs> Carve Overlander. I absolutely love the style of this handle. All brass, beautifully, made. I love this razor. It's one of my favourite razors in the den. It's a three-piece razor and inside there is a blade I trust and I know we're going with, this is the Tuck, Sunny Supreme Stainless. That light's a bit bright here. Let me adjust it a little bit. A bit better? Yeah, that's a bit better. That's what it looks like in the wrapper. First use. So how you all been doing? How you all been coping with all this heat? It's been absolutely scorchio here in North Wales. Slightly overcast today though, but the last last two, three weeks has been absolutely fantastic. Let's get that loaded. Made in Canada. As you probably all know, blade alignment looks good. No overhang to speak about. Right, let's get all that, no, create the leather. <laughs> Three flicks of the brush so it's wet but not dripping. And I'll fill you in. Right. As you've known from the other videos, um, we go through, me and Mrs. B, we've been going through a pretty Pretty tough time with, um, well, for the last six months with her parents' ill health. And they're okay, they're still with us, but their health is deteriorating. And I won't go into it all because we were supposed to be moving to Scotland and everything. Anyway, all that being said, work was starting to get on top of me with all everything that's been going on. And I left, I've resigned from my job a month ago. And I've been going through a huge emotional curve because I, I gave 20 years of my life to that to that business. And it was no longer a company that I fell in love with. Um, the delivery side of it and meeting all the people and all, all the friends I've made and everything on delivery I miss a lot, but my mental health started to deteriorate with the last six, what's been done the last six months. The, the, the only thing that helped me escape from it all and everything like that was keeping myself occupied at work and everything, but it got too much. Um, for my mental health, I had to leave. Um, 
What topped it off was January. I did my twit. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at that. Beautiful bass. So easy to lather. What topped it off for me? I did my 20 years service in January. And do you know what I got for 20 years service? 20 years dedication of my life? A pop-up card that you'd give a five-year-old for the birth year. It will be popped up, said congratulations. And I thought to myself, is that all I'm worth to this company? Wet and wash. And it played on my mind for, for a few months. I'm going to go and help it. Everything's starting to get to me. So I resigned. That was the first step. And then I've, I've, I've stayed away from everything as, as much as possible. More or less lived as a recluse and doing odd jobs around the house that obviously fell back with the last six months. Let's get lathering. So that is what's been happening. I've stayed away from everything as much as possible. I popped in now and again. And sort of kept in touch on the Facebook groups, social media, but I needed, I needed a break. I needed time for me. And it's done me an absolute world of good. And I, I already had plans of what I wanted to do work-wise. See, I, I knew I was worth more than a pop-up card. At the water out. <coughs> so I decided I wanted to work for myself exactly like Mrs. B is doing. So the meeting today is with DPD. They are a good company, but we're going to be working for ourselves. C Caroline, the wife, uh, Mrs. B, everything all runs one. I've been doing it for about a month now and she absolutely loves it. So I've bought into a franchise at a different depot. Um, Mrs. B's in Abigail, not too far from here on the north northwest coast. I'm going to a depot in Deeside. Here we go, guys. First pass. I've done this for a while. I've not been shaved and I've just been trimming the beard. But I've had it and it cut my hair this morning. I'm going to freshen myself up with a nice shave. This feels great. I, I, I miss the feel of the blade on the skin. So, yeah, that's, that's basically what's been happening. I need a time out for me. Um, and it's done me a world of good. I feel, now I've got no stress or pressure on me whatsoever. And it was, it was stressful going into work, I, anxiety. You know it's bad when you get up in the morning and you start heaving at the thought of going to work. That's not good. That's not healthy. I mean, that's the way it was getting. So I said, nah, I'm not having this. So that's where I've been, guys. It's purely... My choice. Nice sharp smooth blades these, the Sunnies, made in India, I don't think I've ever had a, a bad blade ever from India. This feels great. So, yeah, Mason the dog, the puppy is doing well, he's 21 weeks tomorrow. And he weighs just under four stone. He's huge. He, oh, I say huge. He's huge for a puppy. But yeah, he's doing well. He's coming along absolutely brilliant. Mrs. B's good and well. Um, it's, I don't know, it's, it's, it's the difference 
in my head and my body and everything since I left Royal Mail, it's unbelievable. I feel more like myself. I've got more energy, mind you, I haven't been doing much, that's why. I've got more energy. But I'm not walking 11 mile a day. So that, this is why, as well, I'm going to DPD. It's more money, I'm working for myself. I'm my own boss. So I appreciate myself and know my value more than a company, even you know what I mean. I'm sorry if this goes on a little bit. I don't care. I'll take the time and enjoy it. No pressure. And I made a vow to myself not to be put under pressure like that and stress ever again. Because it doesn't help when you get PTSD, but that's had nothing to do with this last month. It was purely down to me. But I've noticed that the channel is still growing slowly, albeit, and it has affected the channel, we're not uploading. I'm no longer in um, a partner the partner thing with um, YouTube, they kicked me out, they gave me 30 days notice, but that was to be monetized, but I declined the monetization, I'm not in it for the money, I'm in it for the love of the hobby of filming and wet shaving, talking bollocks for you guys. <laughs> so that's it, that's what's been happening. Oh, do you like the new shirt? Designed it myself? The new company where I was based in Mold, Royal Mail, fantastic shop. <coughs> what was it called again? The Craft Shack, if you can see that. Lovely lady owns it, Emma. And I'm picking another one up today that I designed myself. I thought, you know, get back into it, get a couple of new t-shirts going, and they do absolutely everything. But I'm not on commission. She's not asked me to do that. I just, I was so impressed with all the work because I've been in the shop. And I've had a look online as well. I'll put a link um, into the shop just in case you want to get anything personalised for the birthdays or anniversaries or anything, the online shop. I've seen her work in the shop and I, I was impressed. And um, the speed that she did this shirt and my other one, I've, I've got to pick it up today on the way to the meeting. Um, yeah, I was I was impressed, and they do absolutely everything. Any clothing, item, plates, you name it. Have a look at the sites anyway. So yeah, I thought, uh, thought I'd treat myself to an update. I know we're halfway through the year, guys, 2023, but the other one hasn't got a year on it or anything, so I can use that all year round, whatever year it is. Across the globe. <laughs> yeah. God. So yeah, things have been things have been okay. Lately, I've been quite a bit done around the house and everything. Jobs that were getting neglected. Because we're spending all our time at work and then looking after the parents. Straight after work. So yeah, everything, everything's good guys, everything's good. Oh, I want to get back into making the videos again because I've missed them so much. Thank you for all your comments on the last shave. Oh yes, the last shave. A few of you were, um, were asking about the upgrade on the internet. How good is it? Oh my God. Um, the, the last shaving video I did was 35 minutes long. Which Kevin found him use. I, I, phoned, I, I phoned him up just, just for a quick chat, see how he was getting on anything a while ago. <laughs> He's like, what's this you do, 35 minute video? <laughs> He's trying to be like me. I was just, no, I just, because of how quick the internet is now, I'm not rushing to get a video down to 20, 20 25 minutes. I can take my time a bit more. 
and talk about all you guys. Anyway, before the upgrade, my average 23, 25 minutes or so video would take anything between two and a half and three hours to upload. I know. The last video I did was 35 minutes long, like I said. It uploaded in seven minutes. I actually thought I did something wrong. So that's how quick it is. And the unboxing video, that took 12 minutes. And it, it was only like a 15 minute video, but I, I uploaded it in a different format. Just experimented. Oh, this feels great. I've missed it. Yeah, that, that was... It's part of it as well with the um, doing the videos with much crap internet. It was it was demoralizing because it was so slow. But now, huh, sky's a limit, eh? So how's your shave's been going, guys? Don't forget to let me know your shave of the day. Hashtag shave of the day. And Paul, I haven't forgotten about your ages. I know you mentioned it and everything, but I've been recluse. I've, I've not. I've barely gone anywhere. So, yes, again, I apologise. Robert, I spoke to you about your razor, so uh, yes, I am going to use it and then I'm going to pass it on. Oh, God. Apologies to everybody. It's life, unfortunately. Here we go, my favourite pass against the growth. Yeah, I've got this meeting. Oh, it is. It's not an interview. I've never had an interview because I'm self-employed and buying into a franchise for the company. It's just been all meetings online, but this is this is my first face-to-face one-on-one meeting, just, just to go over a few things and show me around the depot. Clarify a few things up, get things straight. And then, as far as I know, I have, uh, if it's the same as Mrs. B, four days training. I don't really need the training, but I suppose it's a formality. And the company does things slightly different, obviously, from Royal Mail. So, yeah, looking forward to it. Be my own boss. I was self-employed many years ago. Uh, call it a vehicle restoration technician. In other words, a valeter. I did it for about 11 years and I was quite successful, but I got carpal tunnel. I couldn't, I couldn't do the job properly anymore. So I moved on. So far, so good. No, no nicks, no weepers. Famous last words, eh? Yeah, when I came back after the hard time through the beginning of the year, I thought, oh, great. But, but it's one thing after another in work. I mean, I, I started losing sleep, heaving before I went into work. I, I thought, I, I, I can't be doing this. Way left. Um, it's not me. There was two of us on the same day that handed in our notice, and I believe another lady handed hers in last week.
And I know for a fact there's a few more going as well during the rest of the year. So that's how bad that it's gone. It's not just me. It, it's it's nationwide. Usual round the neck area. The old suspects for the pickups. How long have we been going? I don't I don't know. Not even timing it. Not even timing it. Take your time, Chris. No rush. You can always fast forward it, can you? <laughs> Here we go. Pick up time. So I'll go to this meeting and what have I got planned for the rest of the day? Well, actually, with the weather being overcast, I think there's a little bit of rain coming. I'm just going to chill out. I was busy all day yesterday and I struggled in the heat as well. So I'm going to chill out. I might even get a couple of sides in for this afternoon because I'm not going in anywhere else then after that. I did start sorting the den out because it's been it's it's been a mess. It got so unorganised and messy because I ran out of room. And I started doing that. I suppose I need to get it finished and uh, give it a new shape then to cold water rinse. Alan. Feel human again. Yeah, I started drinking a little bit more as well, to be honest with you guys, and that's not like me. Even though I do like a tipple. Slight zing around the under the chin, but I, I haven't had a blade on my skin for a month. Rinse that off. Love a fresh towel on your face. Because some people say, why do you use two towels? Well, the one I just wipe my hands on is probably been in the bathroom 24 hours, just a hand towel for washing your hands. And I just use to wash my hands and then it goes in the wash with this one. But I just love the peel of a lovely, fresh, soft, fresh towel on my skin after the shave. <laughs> Matching splash. <coughs> it's a beautiful scent. It smells like summer. It really does. It really does smell like summer. It's a great scent. It's not like bang refreshing. It's um, it's a relaxing scent. Well, that feels nice. Wow, that is nice. That is so good. Mm. And I'm going with Sterling's Unscented for the splash because I'm going to a meeting and I want to smell nice. I don't want any, any scented there. Uh, and I'll probably put a little bit more of that on. That's all you need. Besides, that's all you need. I don't uh, I'll probably put a bit more on before I, I go out. It's a beautiful scent. Wow. There you have it. Don't forget your lug holes. And your elbows. It's one thing I noticed as well, the job. Well, I used to get all dry skin and everything on my elbows at work. That's gone. Elbows feel a lot better. I'll leave a... A list in the description of everything used and a link where I can and I'll leave a link in for Craft Shack. Just have a look. Right, that's it. Thank you so much for your company. Thank you so much for sticking with me. Welcome new subscribers and that's it. Right, um, I will see you soon on the next shed. This is it, I'm back, I'm back into it. Even if I'm knackered in the week or whatever, 
I'm still shaving now. Um, because I've got I, I can go into it whenever I want, finish when I want, and then so. all good. Right, I'm gonna leave you and wish you a happy weekend. Um, yeah, thanks guys. Stay smooth and stay safe. Bye now.